Nothing great has ever been achieved without enthusiasm. This is Samuel Adams, the Boston Terrier. Our daily walks help me unplug from the noise of modern life and gain the clarity and focus I need to become a better version of myself. Join us for some motivation, inspiration, and transformation. Nothing great has ever been achieved without enthusiasm. I think that's a great quote from Ralph Waldo Emerson. It's so true, a few years ago, I was enthusiastically talking about how to hire young agents in the insurance industry. And uh, I got Insurance Journal and Independent Agent Magazine and Applied Systems, all these different uh, publications contacting me saying, hey, would you come on our podcast? Or would you uh, write an article for us? Or, you know, just give us some, th some thoughts on the topic. And, um, Sorry, Sammy is just enthusiastically trying to get away. <laughs> um, and they, uh, you know, they said, each of them, hey, we, we asked you because you're so enthusiastic about the topic. And I think it speaks to the point that enthusiasm tends to persuade people. And in a sales and service industry, that's super important, right? We need to persuade uh, prospects, clients about a number of different things, whether it's, you know, buying coverage, adding coverage, uh, there was even a study done by University of Minnesota and Michigan State years ago that had hundreds of people involved and basically proved that when people were exposed to other people who were enthusiastic, they were much more likely to be persuaded about whatever it is that they were talking about. So uh, I just challenge you to use uh, the power of persuasion through being enthusiastic in whether you're in sales, service, or anything in between, um, and find ways to become more enthusiastic and you know, get deep with it. Uh, really, really fall in love with what you do, because if you don't, what are you doing, right? So be enthusiastic in order to persuade people. Until next time, friends, be well.